Hi, this is Jeff Ward with the Northwest Avalanche Center out here in the Stewart Range today. We're near uh, 7,000 feet and traveling along ridges and taking a look at these huge cornices that are growing up here. They're definitely enormous. Wind is moving. We have some moderate west winds and it's uh, loading these east slopes and uh, growing the cornices even larger. So we're traveling on this ridge and avoiding all avalanche terrain today with the high hazard, new snow, warming temps, strong winds. This is our safest terrain right here on the ridge. We're planning to ski low angle west facing terrain today. Uh, it'll be off to Mike's right there. Uh, it's below 30 degrees and actually has been a little scoured by the wind. Probably not the best skiing, but some of the safest. Hi, this is Jeff again. We're just coming down from our day of skiing. Things have warmed up considerably. Uh, we definitely have an upside down snowpack right now. Uh, one of the quick tests you can do to see if you have an upside down or higher density snow over low density snow is just a real quick hand pit. I could do this with a shovel or if I don't want to take the time getting it out. I can just do a really quick dig here, isolate a column. I isolated all the way down to that crust. This is the storm snow that we've had over the last couple days. And if I pull on the back of it, I just want to see if it comes out cleanly. Definitely. So we have a bit of a storm slab here. It's lower density snow and then it gets a little heavier. Not the ideal setup. This is, should probably settle out pretty fast, but until it gets cool again, this is going to be a problem.